Chabalaba showed face, it's Ray from Goshen Carnage, and today we're here to talk about our new, brand new Die C11 pants. Uh, these were for, directly from ANS Gear uh, a while ago, and um, yeah, Die pants, great pants. Alright, we go from the top down. So we got the waist, is um, Velcro elastic waist, little stretch to fit almost any size. Um, get a little thing here for hanging them up in case you get crotch sweat and you just want to like let it air out, you know. Now this thing in the back, I don't know what it does, I don't think anybody does. Yeah, I have it on my Empire pants, I don't it's know what the hell that is. Pointless thing, just more advertising. Maybe for like, ass pads, I don't yeah, know. Yeah, no, no. Yeah, no. sliding There's on your ass. Hip <laughs> pads over here. Oh, wow. Pocket, no zipper, it's a big point. Uh, more hip pads, another pocket, um, great cross protection. You get a button, Velcro, zipper, Velcro, standard, uh, closing protection. And then here we have extra breathable material. Right here, it's really, really awesome. And moving down, where am I? Okay. Moving down, we have more crotch breathability all throughout here. And then light padding over here, again, where your knees are going to be up. And then awesome knee padding, okay? I feel that. Yeah, oh, man, yeah. that's nice. That's really nice. And then the standard uh, cinch ankles. Flip the pants over real fast. And you see the back, there's absolutely nothing except for jersey mesh. This is a plus and a minus. If you're cold and you want to play in the cold and stuff, this is not good, but... It's very, 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 very light, so you can run around faster and do and stuff. It, and it sucks for those of you who are getting shot in the back. Yeah, then you're stupid. It's yeah. not supposed to be getting shot in the back. <laughs> All right, we got a couple things to go over. Um, pockets, okay? These pockets are really great. They're deep. They're they're well placed. But two things, all right? There's no zippers on them. My Gen X Global Pants had zippers. That's really saying something. And also, there's no squeegee pocket anywhere. Like, you can scour these pants out for days and you're not gonna find a squeegee pocket on them. That's quite a disadvantage and really a letdown for dye. Um, being $170 pants is the most expensive pants you could buy today. And uh, no squeegee pocket is just, just stupid. Um, so for functionality, give it a seven out of 10. Mobility otherwise, these are some of the lightest pants you can get. They have padding in all the right places and no padding where you're moving a lot. They're extremely, extremely light. And um, overall, for mobility, 10 out of 10. Overall, oh. give these pants an 8 out of 10 just because no squeegee pockets because it's a huge mistake on Dai's part and it's absolutely imperative during speedball play. That's about it on the Dai C11 tournament pants. These are $170 on ansgear.com. Um, I'd recommend them to any paintball player. Great pants, but just make sure when you hide your squeegee pocket in your pocket, make sure you don't stab yourself in the nuts.